Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today I'm going to show you how to create these diamonds using circle grids. Let's go. First step, I'm going to select the stroke. I'm going to de decrease the stroke thickness to 0 0.25. I'm going to select the circle. Select the ellipse tool, press and hold Shift plus Alt, create a circle. Press and hold Alt, drag it down until they intersect right here. Select both of these circles, select the rotate tool, double click on it and type in 60 degrees. Click on copy, press Control D, so it's going to create a new copy on there. And select one circle, press and hold Alt so you can create a new copy and drag it here where they intersect in between those two circles. Now select the rotate tool again, press and hold Alt and go here into the center where you can see the anchor point here. Click on it, 60 degrees. Click on copy, press Ctrl D until it goes round and round. Select the pen tool and I'm going to connect this point with the right one and the bottom one. So it's going to create an upside down triangle and I'm going to do the same thing, connecting it from here to here. So it's going to be a normal triangle here. From here, I also going to click again on, on in between these two circles where they intersect. Click on it and end it here into the other intersection point. I'm going to go and double click on the rotate tool again, 60 degrees again, copy and control D again. So this is the grid system. Okay. I'm going to select all of this, right click and group. Now I'm going to increase the stroke thickness to one, two, three. I'm going to go with three, select the pen tool and I'm going to start connecting these from here. And it's going to go something like this. Now we're going to create a square from this point to the right point and you go up, make a connection. And from here, click on the rotate tool again, select it and press and hold alt, go again to the center anchor point and click 60 degrees again, click on copy, control D, control D until it goes around and around. And this is how you make this diamond happen using these circle grids. Thank you so much for watching and if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye.